so ready for some more guardians tonight. We just escaped with our <laughs> barely our lives in tonight, and I thought we'd lost Gamora as we took on the Church of the Universe. Sounds like Murder Mom's feeling more stabby than usual. Woo. Hey, better not slice through anything in that cargo bay. We ain't restocking anytime soon. <laughs> Harsh. Excuse me, I ain't the one advocating to throw ourselves to the Florkins. You all right there, Drax? I am pondering that question. And that makes total sense. After what happened with Nikki and that twisted promise, having to watch the people we love die all over again. My family did not simply die. They were murdered by Thanos. I think I'm... I do not wish to discuss it. And of course, there he is. Move over. What are you looking at? The Iron Bull oh, no. one. You ain't chewing through any more of my ship. My ship. Shoo! Flark off! Wow, that panel must have looked really tasty. What's it for, anyways? Emergency door controls for the ship. Something a ship owner should know. Hey, do I look like an engineer? You don't. Iron Brew Llama just pulling his weight again as usual. Yeah, I'm definitely sticking with the leather jacket quill. I just I can't. I'm gonna run the Nova Core one for Rocket because it's kind of cool. Yeah, it's not that different. So, Ooh, want a dead one to change though. Hey Tom, how is it going sir? How are you doing? I did want to change Drax to that. Alright, let's go. How are you doing though Tom? How is it going sir? Are you having a good evening? Hope it is going well. We are jumping back into Guardians. I'm actually awake enough to play the game tonight, which is nice. Last couple of weeks, I have been so tired after putting the kids to bed. I literally been passing out on my sofa. So. What are you working on, Rocket? Uh, just a little upgrade for the Milano's weapon systems. I told you I put that quarantine zone tech to good use. If you hit it from Nova Core. Cool. How soon can we try it out? Uh, depends on how long you're gonna stand there bothering me. You want something? It's more fun crafting my stuff, but I'll lend you a paw. Oh, Tom, I was gonna say as well, um. Super hyped for the next Dungeons and Dragons session. We've been so excited to get into the next one. Um, you need to, if you've not, go and check out like some of the view figures for our sessions. Like, I'll, hey, it's got a lot of I views considering we've got two episodes up. Considering we've got like two episodes up, we've got quite a good few views on it already for a brand new Dungeons and Dragons campaign. Nothing in here. Wait, really? You're talking YouTube and Twitch? We've got a good few views on um, YouTube, and because the Twitch sessions disappear, like they, they only stay up for like two weeks. Um, but on YouTube we're getting, we've got a good few views on them, but we've got a good number of listens as well on like the, um, the audio versions. Like consider we're a brand new one, like we're, it's not too bad. I mean it's not groundbreaking or anything, we're not like, we're not chasing Critical Role quite yet, but you know, it's really good for a new Dungeons and Dragons podcast. <laughs> Well, if I had to counter I'd like the streaming thing, it's like it literally is just him like air guitar it. Checking all the rooms just in case there's anything I need. No? Anybody in there? Drax? Are you okay? Open up! Peter Quill. Are you gonna join us in the cockpit? You had a lot of dog report items for Cosmo. 
Perhaps I will. I'll write them down. Drax. Apologies. I will surrender the laboratory. In a few ticks. Wait. Was that my toothbrush? That's what I thought was really brushing his head with your toothbrush, dude. I love how that door on Hope the fridge. Somebody makes the right call and gets us out of the way of those church idiots. And just keep like opening it. It ain't cowardice, it's common sense. Hello, I am real armor. Siding with Green Team on this. Yeah, well, a little bit is all we'd achieve before getting brain scrubbed and tied up to faith reactors. Watch hey. it, Peter. Hey, Gamora. Go away, Peter. Come on. Just thought I'd check in. That was some pretty heavy stuff you said earlier. Wanna talk about it? I don't need a pep talk. Okay. All right. No talking. Let's sing it out. What? Oh, oh, oh. who's the hunter? Who's the game? <laughs> you feel the beat? Call your name. Come on, I know you know this one. I hold you close in victory. Or oh, there somebody that like a thing for MCU characters and like what? Style. You won't be uh, they would be in Dungeons and Dragons, and they said wild. Peter Quill's going to be a bard, on, and I'm like, I can see it. Shooting at the walls of Shooting at the walls of heartache. Bang bang. I am the warrior. Well, I am the warrior. And heart to heart you <laughs> win. <laughs> See? Just singing. Alright. I like that one. Gets me every time. What did you want to talk about? Want to talk about the guy whose arm you just ripped off? There's nothing to talk about. You chopped his arm off. And that's all I did. He's still out there with Nikki manipulating her with his <coughs> slick lies and flarked up promises. Making everybody think... Had a little too close to home for the world, I think. Who did you see? In your promise. Got a feeling it wasn't Thanos. No one. Nothing. It was just a lie. Which is why we need to stop it. Right. I'm working on that. Just... Try not to slash the cargo bay in half. Could you move? Nothing in here? Yeah. Yeah, I think so. What do you think, bud? Now that Contraxi is gone, What's going to be the new hotspot for entertainment? One whole arm. That's what? 10% of Raker down? And I say we leave the other 90% alone. Can't say I ain't glad I get to dissect this little marvel. But that's as close as I'm getting to this flarking cult ever again. Yeah, I guess we're talking to Cosmo. Oh. Bruce up here. How about you, bud? You doing okay? <laughs> Are you sure? We saw some pretty messed up stuff in there. I am Groot. Yeah. Maybe I'm not the best person to discuss it with you. <laughs> you and Rocket should definitely talk about it, though. <laughs> I'm glad you guys are there for each other. Take care, buddy. Anything yet? Guardian of Galaxies. Cosmo, buddy, where have you been? We've been calling you. I'm sorry, Peter Quill. Cosmo's ball is being tied. Universal Church of Truth arrive at nowhere. What? Are you okay? He's fine for a moment. Cosmo receive warning in time. But Continuum Cortex is of shutdown for safety. It's been dead, huh? Your little detective trip almost got us killed. We'll fill you in when we get there. Yet, this problem is bigger than Cosmo. Guardian of Galaxies must go to Xandar and ask Worldmind for help instead. 
Cosmo on the main time. Get through. Guardian of Galaxy must actually. Cosmo, are you there? What happened? They're on the world main time. Oh. Crap, we're under attack. Are we under attack? So these are the cowards who defiled Lady Hellbender's honor. Oh, good. And who the flock are you? Normally, I would not engage in conversation with inferior life forms. But my contract with Lady Hellbender stipulates otherwise. Therefore, abomination. You may refer to me by my title. I am Captain Glory, leader of the Lethal. Have a good one, my friend. Uh, See you in the Legion? third. Uh, See like you then. Legion. Have a good one, Tom. Thanks for stopping by, brother. Surrounded us. Listen, I get that Lady Hellbender's super pissed, but now's really not the best time. Did you think that she would ease her bounty simply because you somehow managed to elude the Blood Brothers in nowhere? Yes. Then you were as imbecilic as they are. You will not elude me. That I can assure you. Just need a few minutes. Stall him, Quill. Why? Where are you going? Did you mute me? <laughs> what? So, how much is Lady H offering you anyway? Is it like a lot? Or are you making a counter offer? Maybe. Depends. What would it take? Nothing. Everyone's got a price, Glory. Even you. I don't expect those of lower races to understand the basic principles of honor and superiority. When I commit to a contract, I follow through. Always. Yeah, okay. How much for your honor, then? I cannot be bought. Certainly not by low-life scum such as yourselves. I am Glory of the Kree Empire. And I look forward to the day when the Kree race eliminates your inferior species. Spoken like a true Kree. <laughs> More like an arrogant a-hole. Enough! I will not be disrespected. You will be eliminated. Give me your best shot, Helmet Head. The Milano's gonna blow you out of the sky. Your ship doesn't have that kind of firepower. Scan again. Just a little something system. we picked up. From the, uh, nice. Looks like you underestimated us. Let's do it. I think Captain Glory and the Lethal Legion. Oh no. Hit them hard and give no quarter. There's nothing on that garbage scow. Fire! Ah, ha, 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 ha. Hang in there, bud. They ain't killed us yet. Drop out and get a better angle if it gets too hot. I got this. Trust me. Where's Drax the Destroyer? My bounties are five of you. Ain't a bad question. Can't we just send an IOU to Lady H? I ain't paying that psycho a single unit! I am Groot! Stop barking orders, Groot. You don't even know how to fly her. Alright, should I get a hang of the ship here? This is not going well. Jeez, how much money did she offer these guys? More than that strategy. I would love to hunt you down. Feed your ego? No thank you. Feels kind of good to have bounty hunters after us. We for making a name for ourselves, right? Unlike you, I have done my research in Peter Kill. So many controls to get used to Feel flying the ship. Well, they insulted my baby. Just make sure you're shooting while you do it. These guys have really bad timing. Another problem for our pile of problems. Come on. These ships 
Bones ain't dying fast enough. That's a fixable problem. Try and turn the ship, and the ship just stops. Stop orders, you don't even know how to fly her. Jeez, how much money did she offer these guys? Doesn't matter. She wasted her money. Please try to see. I would love to hunt you down. And feed your ego? No, thank you. Come on. Play two ships left, let's do it. <laughs> Only one lethal name brain left. One is all we need. That don't even make sense. We just wasted a ton of you. <laughs> Feels kinda good to have bounty hunters after us. We for making a name for ourselves, right? Unlike you, I have the very same kill. Here. Somewhere there. Oh. Oh, 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 oh. Try not to get shot, Quill. Woo! There we go. <laughs> Who's the inferior life form now, huh? Drop Still. out and get a better angle if it gets Peter. Hot. I'm picking up something. What? Oh. It appears I'll have to finish this myself. So you defeated my fighters. My cruiser will crush you. Do not fly straight into the ship. Good to know. Good to know. Okay. We can do this. We can do this. I suck at vehicle stuff, but... That's it? That's what you've been bragging about? What do you mean? <laughs> Nothing. It's well, I'm sure it's very comfortable. I will not be mocked. Then do something about it. That did some real damage. Keep hitting his exhaust ports. 
Your strategy will work. Thanks. You just confirmed that it will. Lady Skull Suit us the worst flark in timing! Feel that, Guardians? Nope, not a thing. Milano definitely felt it. Ooh, Bayfield. Starting to feel like we pissed off the whole galaxy. I'm pretty sure we have. The barrage. I love it. Pissed off the whole galaxy, and I'm like, yeah, kind of. Yeah, I don't think the scrap sacks care if the galaxy's under siege. You know, contractors. We're contractors. It's really pissing me off. Oh, he's up there. that one we really got to take better care of the milano yeah we were a ship wash and a wax when this is all over right after you patch up all the holes all right protect our points Ooh. this guy's starting to sound like rocket it's called language efficiency well How much these creeps are getting paid for killing us? You okay in there, Cap? Stay still, and I'll shoot you. Mm. Or how much these creeps are getting paid for killing us? There we go. Take that, Lady Skull Scut. I doubt we've seen the last of her. We'll worry about Lady Hellbender later. Let's just focus on getting to Xandar. That was fun. Punch it. He had a Chewbacca on his desk and he didn't say punch it, Chewie. I am disappointed. What? Yep. Old girl needs a tune up. We can do it once we reach the station. I ain't letting no bucket head near my... Wow. Talk about cosmic gridlock. Whoa. I haven't seen this many ships around Xandar since the start of the Galactic War. Everyone's coming Over to Xandar. channel group. Let's see what's going on. Ships come from converted worlds. They're refugees. I need immediate docking permission. Please answer us. Groot, that's enough. I don't see any rescue shuttles coming out. No. They're ignoring them. No. No, 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 no. Nova Corps might be a bunch of self-righteous dome heads, but they're they're supposed to be helping folk. That's their whole flarkin' deal. Relax, Rocket. We'll just call the station and ask to speak to the world mind. Groot. <sighs> Welcome to Novacor headquarters. Please state your preferred language of communication. I know, bud, but now we can all follow along with Starpan's mistakes. How may we assist you? We should report what Raker is up to. Think the Flarkin world mind doesn't already know? Maybe not ever. Oh, fuck you! We, we are, are aware of the current threat, but can devote no, no resources toward fighting it. Just pick something, Peter. How about future crime? Great idea! 
Thank, Thank you for being proactive. However, the galaxy's impending doom makes all future crimes irrelevant. After scanning your ship, our near-perfect algorithms pre-selected several officer choices. The allocation of resources for direct communication with us has been denied. We apologize for the inconvenience. Well, it was worth a shot. Let's try something else. I am Groot. I am Groot. Groot wants you to pick world mine. Nova number 11249-44396 is out of our sensor range and unavailable for contact. Of course, I'll show us if he Richard Rader. Sounds Terran. You seriously don't know who he is? I have yet to meet a Terran of any interest. Scroll down! Scroll down! Nova Prime's identity is confidential, and communication with them is forbidden until further notice. Huh. Doesn't say which one. Why even list them then? Hey, Warberry, got any ideas? We should tell them about the promise. Right. As if none of these other ships ain't already blasting about it all over the cons. Due to the imminent termination of civilization, we are unable to open new cases. Do you think turning ourselves in would get their attention? Thank you for attempting to be an upstanding citizen. As all prisons are being evacuated, congratulations on your decision to join the Corps. To begin, state your full name, designation, or serial number. Richard Ryder. Star Lord. This strategy is futile. Ah, oh, come on, muscle brain. Please save your celestial body or artificial installation of origin. Someplace. Earth. Earth. I continue to doubt this strategy. Sheesh. Finally, in a few words, describe, describe what made you want to join Nova Corps. Because I'm a sucker. justice. <laughs> Looks like the best AI in the world can parse that. What's that, boys? Not today. Nope. So that was fun, but a complete waste of time. Any other ideas? Connecting to banking services. I can't believe that worked. Guardians of the galaxy. Explain yourselves. Hey, world mine. Long time no see. It's me, Peter Quill, Star Lord. And, uh, it's Guardians of the Galaxy. Check the addendum. We need your help. To pay a fine? No. No, of course not. You need to save the, the galaxy. The galaxy cannot be saved, Peter Quill. What? A mass delusion known as the Promise is sweeping its systems, converting all who encounter it. In less than three cycles, it has spread from the crew of a single star frigate to multiple outposts. Worlds and systems. Praxis 9, Rigel 3. 75.222% of the Andromeda galaxy, galaxy, all lost. Of course, she don't mention Contraxia. They, actually, the world mind's collective consciousness. Look, we know who's behind the promise. We've seen it happening up close and personal. We're here to pass on information to you so you can stop it. How can we be more clear? The Universal Church of Truth cannot be stopped. Told you, they're a collective. It is a machine. Yeah, well, so are parts of me. And you better not call me an it. <laughs> it can be stopped. Maybe not by us. But you're a war hero. You defeated the Shatari 12 years ago. The, the resistance, resistance and its allies defeated the Shatari, not us alone. And not before the Shatari had destroyed our home world and decimated our people. Yeah, I don't like it either, bud. Should have run when we had the chance. We have already processed 12,472,865 combat scenarios. The current probability of defeating the Universal Church of Truth is 0.3%. That is a big number. Is that bad? It sounds bad. It is. Now, if you will excuse us. 
The Universal Church of Truth's forces draw closer to this region of space. It is critical that we depart before they arrive. You're running away? What about the refugees? You're just gonna leave them defenseless? Our primary directive is the preservation of Zandarian culture. All else is secondary. <laughs> Have you seen what your planet looks like? Zendarian culture is a lost cause. Culture is more than a location. But you're Nova Corps leader. You have a duty to protect this galaxy. That, that is incorrect. You ain't the leader of the Bucketheads. We do, we do not, not have a duty to protect this galaxy. galaxy. We, we merely police it to get advanced knowledge of potential threats. Serve and protect only yourselves. A logical byproduct of our primary directive. directive. Officers all over the galaxy laying down their lives for you. And you won't even risk fighting for their sake? The, the risk, risk is too great. It, it would be, be a pointless, pointless sacrifice. For unknown reasons, the church has stopped filing resources. Its, its influence, influence has grown beyond all probabilistic models. models. Then update your models. We, we cannot adjust our computations to the, the enemy's nonsensical power, power source. You mean faith energy? Faith, as an energy source, is illogical. We are unable to compute scenarios to fight that which should not exist. So you're just gonna let the church win? If the power source cannot be quantified, it cannot be countered. Most sentient beings don't have the luxury of calculating their odds before getting into a fight. That is why they fail. Don't you control the Nova Force? The magical energy that powers Nova Core? It. It's not magical. magical. But yes. Then how do you explain that one? Because to an outsider, it doesn't seem logical at all. Thanos used to say it was generated by the living computers of Xandar. The, the living, living computers of Xandar are the Nova Force. Force. It exists because we exist. And we exist, therefore it does. Sounds like you're able to harness your collective energy just like Breaker with other people's faith. Maybe the way you do it can tell you how the church does. Perhaps. We recognize that you are displeased with our decision to leave. However, your emotional state is not our primary concern. We did not make this decision without considering all available options. A complete search of our databanks only revealed a single entity with the potential to stop them. What is it? Not what. Who? Adam Warlock, the church's original golden god. Unfortunately, he perished in the last year of the Galactic War. Great. So, no one? We are, we are pleased you reached the same conclusion we did. It appears that our travel preparations are almost complete. Farewell, Guardians of the Galaxy. No, 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 wait! Classic Nova Corps. Ain't helped us then, you won't help us now. Yeah, that little mate wasn't gonna help. What? Are you kidding me? Groot says the Flarkin helpline's still asking for fine money. <sighs> you know what? Screw this. Cancel payment. Peter! What? It's not like Nova Corps is gonna come after us. They're leaving. Exactly. They're leaving. That was our only chance to get this disabler off the Milano. We can't escape the church with a locked ship. Who cares? By the time it activates, we'll already either be converted or dead. Peter, we've got movement. I'm Groot. They're taking off. I was kind of hoping if we didn't pay the fine, it would maybe try and they would maybe try and send like some Nova Corps members or something to us. But well, well, I see it. <sighs> Son of a schmack! Oh, for goodness' sake, the church is here. We got 
Not a chomp, Quill. I know. Trump's promise is becoming real. Peter? Gotta get clear first. Come on. And go! The loser legion must have hit something when they ambushed us. Guys, it's only a matter of time before the galaxy accepts the promise. Sacrosanct is back there. We can't just sit here. Guys. And how are we gonna do that? We're dead in the flock and water. And if they right. find us, we're screwed. screwed. Freely accepted. Oh yeah, and without an engine, we're screwed. Guys, anyway. guys, guys, guys! Enough! Just stop already! I can't hear myself think. Rocket, fix the engines. How am I supposed to do that? I can't even run a diagnosis. I don't care. Just fix it. Scoff. And what are we supposed to do? I don't know. Okay? I can't just conjure up answers every two seconds. Fine. The fairy's got a point, like. The world mind was like the big thing that we were trying to do to help, and it's like, don't. I just can't do this right now. And I'm like, there's no answers to this. We're in a losing fight. I need some rest. Shouldn't have counted on them in the first place. Look, it's our great leader. Hey. Here to yell at me some more? What? No. I really don't feel like small talk. You forgot your toast. Try to see if I can take the toast. More up. You all right in there? Look, we're all frustrated. We did what we could with the world mind, but they weren't even listening. It doesn't matter. They had their minds made up. They were being kind of scut. Mm-hmm. I mean, I did nothing wrong. I was just asking them to do their job. How about doing your job? My job? Have you seen the size of that church ship? What am I supposed to do? Guess you and the world mine aren't so different. What? Maybe it's because I had a tyrant for a dad, but I'm used to people in charge not being afraid to get scut done. What the heck? Like, yeah, there's getting stuff done, and then there's like. Don't call me Rocky. I don't call you Grooty. Hey, Groot. What's that stuff you're drinking? Looks like herbal tea, but uh, not sure about the smell. <laughs> Say, bud. You stay so level-headed. I am Groot. I mean, every time Scud happens and we're down in the ditch, you never seem to lose your morale. I am Groot. Wow. Wish I could understand that. You have it all figured out, don't you? I am Groot. Well, I hope you keep it up. We could all learn something. Okay, it's just a random conversations. It's just like a shrieking. Really? How did you? Oh, he's in my bedroom. I'm gonna get fleas. Come on, girl. No iron 
and brew llamas in the bed. I get what Gamora's saying about like people in charge like not being afraid to get stuff done, but it's like, how do you fight against us? Give him the opportunity. And the bed think. smells great. Well, give him the opportunity to think. Do a flashback here. Yeah, that's the thing. Like, I don't even know what the next thing is. Like, do we try and somehow resurrect Adam Warlock? Is that a thing? We have a ship. This is our room. Uh, Why is it so small? Uh, Look at you. Me. Who? Weird hair. What? What is it? What is this? How are you? Me. Come on. The talking raccoon's waiting for you. Everybody is. Uh, Rocket. Yeah, he was. Fixing that thing that broke. Hey, if we're some kind of big space hero now, why are we running from the bad guys? <sighs> it's complicated. No, it's not. Stop running. And we've landed. <sighs> Groot wanted to let you sleep. Can you believe it? I am back. Thank you so much for hanging out with us and waiting there. Oh, that was so cute. My my youngest had, had fallen out of his bed. He's in a toddler bed. And he had rolled and fallen out. It was just like an all fours on the floor and they just started fussing. So I had to walk with him a little bit and put him back. So thank you so much for hanging out with us. How long was I out? Long enough to fly us all the way to the quarantine zone. Wait, how do we fly out here? Well, do you want to fix your ship or not? My ship. Yes, your ship. Come on, the others are outside. Okay, we are so dreaming. So you flew us all the way here? Yep. Without asking. Hey, I asked. You said, and I quote, I'll take you to the stars. I'll show you who we are. We're space riders with no name. Uh, and then you went back to sleep. And you thought that meant yes? Good enough for me. I am real I'm just vibing apparently. Once we're outside, should I be looking around, lifting stuff? Only if you want to get your hands all sticky. Wait for my signal before you touch anything. Most of the debris out here is... There, let's go! <laughs> Yeah, this is totally a dream. Look who stumbled out of bed. The rodent made decisions in your sleep. Yeah, yeah, I know. Took you long enough. What? Nikki? You're not supposed to be here. You promised you would get me out of here. I know, but... <sighs> Nikki! Guys, don't let it get to you! Won't have to tell me twice! Hey, Seal, how's it going, sir? This is the thing that's going to help me feed the church. What are you doing? 
doing? Heroes don't run. None of this makes any sense! We have to face our fears. Take responsibility. Leave me alone! Why are you chasing me? No! This is all wrong! God, I'm sorry! I don't know what to do! Yes, you do. You do! It's my fault, isn't it? All of it! You were supposed to be a hero. No! This is all wrong! We can't keep running away from our problems. Leave me alone! Why are you chasing me? Take that, you ugly monster thing! Okay, let's stop running that can do other stuff. Yeah, let's go and watch one division this weekend. Oh, nice, Sue. What did you think of it? Quill, we got. Drax. We talked about this, man. You gotta stop. Your illegitimate child was correct, Peter Quill. Hovat and Camaria will be restored. Uh, yeah. Okay. We just need to have faith. Uh oh. Dream? <laughs> uh, Drax, you're kind of freaking me out, man. I had to share the good news, Peter Quill. You have lost your family. Your mother, the Cree woman. You understand the pain that comes from loss. Drax. But with faith, with the Matriarch's promise, our families can be restored. I, I, Drax. I don't... You have accepted her promise, have you not, Peter Quill? Uh, Why? <laughs> totally accepted it. I am super stoked to see my mom again. And rejoin your daughter. Y yes, right, right, my, my daughter. I knew you would see the truth of her light, Peter Quill. Yep, uh, the truth and light, dead. Not dead, uh, my daughter, it's all super great. This pleases me. However, I am less certain of the others. The wooden one may have come around, but I suspect the assassin and the rodent will resist. Mm -hmm. This makes them a dangerous element to our cause. I must eliminate them. Wait! Why? Because <laughs> they're our family, man. Just give them a chance. It's a lot to process. You truly believe they will accept her promise? I, I know it. Uh, take Gamora. Her dad was Thanos. There's going to be some stuff to work through before she can accept it. And, and rock it. <laughs> Where to start? He's literally a walking science experiment. What Nikki, uh, the, the, the matriarch, is, is offering, it's, it's all new territory for him. And the wooden one? You said it yourself. He'll come around. I, I mean, it's Groot, man. He's our rock. Very well, Peter. Good, uh, good. That's 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 great. I'm, I'll, I'll let the others know. Ah, there is no need. We must bring the matriarch here. We'll give them the time they require to consider her promise. Right, uh, right. Because she's a million light years away, and it'll take us time to get there. Already landed on her planet. What? What? Why? Why would you do that? Well, if you had truly accepted her promise, you would know. Perhaps it is better that you wait here for a while and contemplate your faith. Hey! Drax! We can talk about this! Okay, of course. Great. Wasn't bad. Yeah, 
Drax may have kind of joined the church. What? Seriously? I know, it's, it, it's super messed up, Drax. Drax is kind of messed up. He also may have landed us on Sacrosanct to find the Matriarch. But don't worry. Don't worry? Yeah, you know. Be happy. <laughs> Might be able to activate the Milano self-destruct sequence. That's your plan? Ooh, 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 what, you got a better one? A little hard to concentrate with Peter singing. I'm thinking. Ah, uh, think somewhere else. Stop singing. For your information, the Lama thing finds my voice delightful. Her name's Cammy. That's it. We're locked in, but she's not. So, she's an idiot. Doesn't mean she can't help us. Can you transfer ship schematics to my tablet? Maybe give me a camera feed. Yeah, okay. Why? I want to check where Cammy is. Done. Go ahead and grab it. No, not the cassette case. What are you thinking, Quill? Oh, for goodness sake. Okay, this is the most awkward controls ever. Well, Thank you. But it wasn't bad, okay, had a good story. Good twist, ending was kinda eh. Uh, like 80% of that coming. Definitely the worst Marvel thing I've watched. Yeah, honestly, I enjoyed Laura, one of something, anything. Why? Just do it! This is me singing a song. I hope you like it because <laughs> oh, I don't. Wow, she hates your voice. Fuck you! It's good! She responds to singing. Maybe if we direct her to that panel near the cockpit. The emergency door controls. Yes. Just keep singing. I'll use the PA and try to lure her to chew the lock override. She chews everything. This is so random. That was ridiculous. <laughs> I can't believe it worked. We're not 
of the Sacrosanct, or on a planet. Well, that's a flark in relief. Let's get the Scud out of here before Drax comes back with his new best friend, the Kratakan Matriarch. Brock, it's stop. We can't just abandon Drax. Is he even still Drax? I mean, he's been converted. I know. It's just we need to find him and pull him back from the dark side. You're talking about kidnapping Drax the Destroyer. Emphasis on Destroyer. And we've come too far, seen too much awful stuff to abandon one of our friends. Drax is still our friend. That ain't our friend no more. Don't make me pull rank on this, man. Are you pointing your frickin' guns at me? No. no. Not yet. I just need you to understand how serious this is. We're not leaving. Attack in time you showed some Nords. Fine. I'm in. Any other objections? Nope. I'm good. I'm good. Good. Then let's go find our friend. There you go, Quell. Could do this. If there are church forces on this planet. We should have an attack strategy. Okay, here we go. <laughs> we have an attack strategy. Okay, let's go. You know where we are? Ooh. In a flock in Lagoon? How many times I gotta tell you people, I don't like water. Hey, I didn't land here, okay? Drax did. Ah, the stuff is gross. Uh, are you kidding me? Wet fur is the worst. Rocket, <laughs> you all right? That's it. I hate water. I hate being wet, and I hate not getting paid. We're not here to get paid. We're here to save tracks. Anything of interest? Drax the Destroyer. Hi, guys. Mantis is here. Thank 
goodness, because there's Francis. a good chance we were going to lose. How did you... What? Oh, that. Lysa once taught me the art of striking one spot many times. There's an Omphad who teaches me later. Don't worry, Green Meanie's fine. Oh, my man. What are we doing here, Mantis? I told him to come. On nowhere. I saw time inside his mind. The lies that bind. I mean, what's a girl to do? Whisper a course correct, obviously. Friends, Quill? Oh, no. <laughs> Not in this time. Come on. The creepy cave's this way. The what now? The creepy cave. Where the darkest of our future paths will meet. Well, that sounds Dark fun. Dark isn't unknown. Not as in bad. I mean, it might be bad. But no way can it be worse than the futures I did see, because those were definitely bad. Very bad. You don't want to know how bad. Can someone please translate her? The point is, or was, or which parts of the point have I made already? Uh, the creepy cave. Yes, that's right. Big strong heart carries so much sorrow inside. In all futures, he's the one who turns. And in some, we save him, here. Okay. Not gonna lie, I'm kinda lost of this little one. <laughs> so, just to be clear, there's a timeline where me and you. Peter, focus. Right. Uh, what's a Katati? I am. Uh, plant people, like Groot, but uh, lame. The Kotati are a highly evolved, highly sacred race of pacifist beings who grace us with their meditative powers. They also guard the secrets of the ancient cave. Can they temporarily unguard it? Oh no, they take this duty quite seriously. Our only hope of entering is to appeal to their infinite wisdom. Or you know Groot can break away on. That works too. So let the plant do the talking for us. He, he knows what's up. He knows what he's doing. Something that's gonna help Rax. We're all just taking the word of the space case. She's not a space. Apparently, that's just gonna jump ahead some bit. Spooky is right. Uh, more like deadly. Are we sure about this? Nope. Maybe Drax just needs to sleep it off. I mean, he seems fine ish. My telepathic control won't last, little fuzzy. Only Green Meanie's friends ever help him see. Watch out! Double floor! Yeah. Alice didn't sense that one in time. Everyone just remember we're here for Drax. Though, it would be easier if we had some idea of what we're looking for. Oh, for sure. It's always easier when you know things. Like, no, no. But you don't. Not yet. Whoa!
Let's not tell little Fuzzy that. Too late. I heard. Group, a little help here. So, maybe the current's a little stronger than I thought. I'm sure it'll get drier from here on out. Oh, you are so wrong, Stir Fry. Stir Fry? That's a good I, Yeah! Giddy up! Crap! That was kind of close. That one sometimes gets Gamora. I doubt it. You're sure we're headed the right way, Mantis? I think so. Okay, well, it's too wide to jump here. We'll need to look around, find another way. Can he not just like push Let's that over? Is that here. not a thing? Maybe there's another way to cross. The priests never talk much about these caves. Oh, they wouldn't. Way too dangerous down here. Unseen forces, ominous machinations, unknowable energies. There's a reason the Kotadi guard the entrance. Uh, of course there is. I think I've got something over here, Peter. Drax better appreciate how dangerous this dumb plan is. Oh, Green Meanie loves you all so much. He does? In most timelines, anyway. All right, Gamora, let's get up here. Why don't I just blast some of these rocks? Oh, no! no. I don't trust him not to kill us. What's your reason? I have seen so many futures where a little fuzzy dies in this cave. Rocket, are you feeling lucky? I got this. Rocket, just stay to the side and try not to die. Yo, geniuses. This thing above me don't look too sturdy. Knock it loose and we got our bridge. Try your glasses. living on this planet. Maybe they weren't native to Seknarf? 
And this is where Hellbender first got them? Or maybe Hellbender's here, tracking us across the ends of the galaxy. Kaki wants us dead. Maybe H wants us dead. You realize what that means? We're all gonna die? I think I see what he's doing. It means we're a team. When we piss someone off, we piss them off together. Oh, I'm gonna assume that sounded better in your head. Water, fog, and monsters. What's the fucking deal with this place? There has always been a great power here. Yeah, what the fork? Now they're fighting Enka. Oh. There's two of them. Two of what? Oh. Mantis, do these things have anything to do with what we're looking for? Inconclusive. But I'm thinking no. What do you think, Will? Are you best friends? Yeah, maybe not. Another one. Oh my goodness. There we go. That's how you do it. Oh, I remember this part. Something bad happens here. Something we have to avoid. Mantis? Over here. All right. I like Drax as much as the next guy, but I am officially sick of this stupid cave. Oh, bug lady? She couldn't guide her way out of a bathroom. Are you the rock face we're looking for? Not sure if I wanted to answer or not. Whatever gets us out of here. We'll each need to face our fears. Some here, some not. But facing Okay, I keep seeing important. little things watching you know, us. Running is sometimes good too. For you, yes. I'm like Star running guy. past and stuff but like that. Only I'm... until it isn't. You'll see that soon enough. No wait, you should know that already. Don't you remember your dream? How do you know about that? Yeah, no, I just do. Rocket, think you can crawl in there? For what? So I can get eaten by whatever lives inside? The stone faces. Whatever we're looking for is beyond or beneath or behind one of the faces. What do you say, Rocket? Hey, so are you told us it's going? There. Fine, whatever. <coughs> Ugh, smells like rotten spike eggs in here. Okay, setting the charge. Stand back. I don't think this is the one. Right, let's explore. Yeah, doing good. We're delving back into some Guardians of the Galaxy tonight. And... Oh, oh. To bring him ashore, but we also need to remain grounded in the positive. We're his lifeline. Positivity isn't exactly our strong suit. You always underestimated yourself, Gamora. Your thoughts 
Let's wander. It's not safe. Keep focused on that. doing good story how are you doing this evening really did thank you for stopping back in again through your gaming, currently monitoring bath time instead. Ah. Yep. Been there plenty of times. Hero of half world outfit found rocket. Ooh. I will take it. You find anything, Peter? Nothing in there that could save Drax. Is there another face somewhere, Mantis? Mantis? Huh? Oh, yeah. This cave is multifaceted. Get it? Yes, I'm going down here. Oh. All right, I guess we're going this other way then. Over here. You uh, see something out there, Mantis? So many things, too many things. Shadows of a civilization that lived here once before. Forlorn faces that can see like me, horrors yet to come. And other shadows too. Ours, not ours. A figure that's watching us now. Or was watching us then. I see rocks and uh, crystal things. A statue that looks like a face and more rocks. I like yours better. I see something else. I see friends willing to die for another friend. Yeah, well. I'm hoping it doesn't come to that. Found another way. Just me or them crystals look super dangerous. Don't worry your fuzzy little head. You only die from a great fall in two timelines. This probably isn't one of them. Try to regenerate in matter. Ooh, and I almost went right up there, There's that feeling again. The fur on the back of my neck is sticking up. I feel it too pair of eyes watching you. We need to get on those crystals, group. Just let Quill get out there first. I don't want you falling. But yeah, 100%, if you ever get the chance to, I would highly recommend this game. Did they happen to the it is a lot of fun, and I honestly prefer dangerous. this version of Guardians to the ones in the MCU. Even. An ancient danger. But the catch is a lot more. Remembering something now, I think. Pull the catch is a lot more fleshed out. I think what you're seeing is some version of me pushing you off a cliff. Oh, little fuzzy. Your volatility is surprisingly consistent through all versions of time and space. Mantis, back in nowhere, did you know what the church was gonna do? I don't know. I see so many different things at the same time, it's sometimes hard to know where I am. Do they try to take over the galaxy in all realities? Not all, but most. Sometimes it's so noisy, like a bajillion ships taking off at the same time. Finally, the place of a thousand lives, I think. It's gonna help us save Drax? It tries to keep us from saving him. We seek something behind the face, beyond the lies. 
You want me to blow it up? That shouldn't be our answer to everything. What games are in your backlog? Holy crap. I... I literally have got so many games in my backlog, it's not even funny. Thankfully I've now got Game Pass. I am on PC. Ooh, that's loud. Uh, thanks. You don't usually make it. Did the body mention the faces in the dark before? Oh, stop talking, man. Of course I'm angry. I'm wet. Wandering around a cave that's falling apart, looking for Flark knows what. Can you get us through here, Gamora? Flark. I'm going in. No, you mustn't. You don't want me to cut the thing? Wait, no, not you. Something bad is about to happen. Oh, that's it. I'm going in. Look at it. Blow up this statue, save Drax, and get out of here. Yes, but... Time to start trusting our instincts, Quill. Bug Lady said the face is keeping us from helping Drax, so we gotta destroy it. Little Fuzzy. Don't do whatever it is you're about to do! No, no, Don't no, I'm done with all the riddles! Don't not, mm -hmm. not do whatever you're about to do! Let's just hear Mantis out on this, okay? Give me a tick to think, okay? What if the whole place collapses? Then at least you wouldn't have to argue with him anymore! Not helping! Rude, Rocket, do! But yes, yeah, really, I've got so many games between Game Pass and the stuff that's on there, between the stuff that's on Steam, stuff that's on Epic. There are so many good games. And then for the longest time I wasn't able to game, we didn't have a PC that was able to, and I didn't really have, also didn't have um, consoles for it at a certain point. So I've got so many games like from the last like 10, 15 years, ones that I've just like completely missed that have went past me that I want to play. And it's like it's insane. It's absolutely insane. And I'm like, I've got so many games. Maybe I'll get to a bunch of them. Um honestly doing the streaming like this has been like the way for me to get through a chunk of them. Um I love storyline games like this, so like actually getting to play them on stream has like helped me get through a bit of that backlog. Oh! Woo. Close one. You can say that again. Oh, I will. Uh, Mantis. Oh, goody, Drax is up. Work, this is the one where I fail. I've got an anti grab gun. It's okay. The one where I fail is the one where you don't. Shh. Stay with me. Hey, guys! Check it out! I'm totally not dead! Ugh. What? You almost killed all of us! No more blowing things up, Rocket! Ever! You're gonna regret saying that. Sir Mike! Are you smart, when? Why didn't I know that? Maybe you aren't always... Or I forgot. What? Those guns do something again, Quill? He saved Drax after you almost killed us all! How'd a gun do that? Tell him! Snow guy! And that's how it's done. Eh, me exploding stuff is still better. It's really not. Next time we're in a huge <laughs> fight, you're gonna beg me to blow stuff up. Beg me. Next time we're in a huge fight, I'll make sure to remember that. 
more of that weird fog. Oh, be glad you ain't this close to the ground. Oh, little fuzzy never dies from gas in here. Just falling, crushing, chitauri, Wait, water. hang on. Chitauri? Oh, I did, didn't I? Such a funny sounding word. I'm going to show cool enemies into melee range. Very effective against hard for each of them. This is impossible! I thought I'd never see these fuckers again! Thanks. Say, like, this is all stuff for the mist that's creating this stuff. This is definitely they're not all here. That like the fog is creating this stuff. I 
Sache. There we go. Gotta go, man. You need our ship to bed. No problem at all, story. You okay, Mantis? Oh, hey, Gamora. You look less depressed. Wait, we went over that already, didn't we? Yeah, we did. That thing of yours is still bothering you, though, right? What thing? I'm fine. Let's just focus on helping Drax. <laughs> He's gonna be upset he didn't get to fight all those things. Uh, I don't think that any... Just how far down does this cave go? up more than rock monsters i don't think they're looking to make amends well oh maybe i can help i think i speak their language I'm gonna say they're all just like jumping me. Come on. Mantis, are we sure this is where we want to be? Don't leave for that question. Guys, up. We're killing it out there, Quill. You see the look on their faces when they see me rays ring down from on high? <laughs> or the ones they make when they realize Groot's got him tied oh, up in a Hey, Nikki, thanks for the look, sweetheart. <laughs> okay, yes. I get that it's all bubbly and sparkly out there. We're blasting shots at them and it's so much fun. But, if we lose our focus, if we can't let go of these crazy thoughts spinning us upside down, we're done. Who's with me? Let's do it. Feel him. Look out! How come there's no fog around these guys? Maybe they know something we don't. Flap and egg, there we go. Well, that went about as well as expected. Let me do a little. I right, try something. Because apparently this is a thing now. No. 
Lot of crap. I've seen something posted about it the day, and I was like, I don't think that's a thing. Like an actual shout out on Twitch. Shout out for the lovely Nikki, and then also for Story Retold. If you are listening in and not following either of these amazing ladies, please sure? go and show them some love. Oh, maybe I just haven't learned it yet. I think I picked up the word for kill. Or the grunt, anyway. The fog doesn't seem to bother whatever these giant things are. Maybe they're just smart enough to not wander around in it. Unlike some people. I am Groot. I know why we're doing it. And don't think Drax won't hear all about it either. Um, there we guys. Go. Uh-uh. No way. No flarkin' way. Doesn't seem that wet. Like, medium wet. I ain't walking through a flarkin' monsoon. <laughs> Maybe there's a way to use those plants that divert the water. We're a team. We'll figure it out. Are we seriously gonna let this keep us from saving Drax? Sure. You save him while I drown. How does he even grow down here? I don't know. Those big leaves could be useful. Like a dam. Dam what? Yes! It's just a plant plant. How do you plant? We ain't got much choice. What would you guys do without me? Yeah. Where, oh where, would we get another gun? Mora, let's climb up there. Get eyes on the problem. The problem is that Rocky needs to suck it up. Yeah, good luck with that. In Little Fuzzy's defense, he has died drowning in far less water than this. Exactly. Wait, what? <laughs> this doesn't seem absurd to you? He's got a thing with water. What do you want me to do? You're supposed to be his leader. Have you met Rocket? I was gonna say, like, yeah, it was with the leader, I don't know what, the guy's got a fear of water, I don't get how being a leader automatically fixes that. Fear the almighty Star Lord. You say something? Uh, nope. Hey, bug lady, exactly how many times you seen us die horribly? That's one big green star. So this should help the bear. War. Just like that. I don't know how, but don't give him an even bigger head than he's already got. Yeah, and you're taking damage from that. I could try blowing it up, I guess. No! Remember last time you blew something up? Okay, fine. Figure something else out. Uh, it's actually kind of refreshing. Like a quick shower. What do you say, Rocket? I ain't ever showered either, and I ain't gonna start now. Ooh, that was very close to the edge. Okay, that was a little too... something rocket hey Groot can you get me up there I don't know why I keep thinking Groot's on that other he's on his way just tell him how high up we go I always press the wrong button for stuff with Groot I always end up pressing the buttons for rocket no it ain't none of their business what's to understand I ain't a fan of drowning I don't know if there's something else to it, or if hey, it's glitched. If I glitch jump, or... you can catch me, right? Guess we'll find out. That's not very reassuring. Just don't screw up the jump. What is that squeal? Too bad you don't have these sweet guns, Rocket. Keep it up, and I'll swipe them in your sleep. I'm still not entirely sure what we're even doing on this planet. I know Drax and the Mantis is redirected this year because Drax is infected. But like, I, I legitimately don't understand what we're doing here and what the purpose is. Sure, they're big enough 
have to block the water, but they're growing in the wrong direction. You're the only plant that grows that fast. I was gonna say, like, so, like, okay, so we got those things, but. Deprivation was like a vacation compared to the other things. That's why you hate getting wet. Clark, I had no idea. Don't make a big deal out of it. Just prefer to keep dry is all. So how long do we gotta wander around smashing our shins on rocks? Imagine it's a metaphor. You're in the physical darkness, and that reflects green means mine. We can double back along Bruce's path and then try to find the exit. Parking visor. It ain't a flashlight, Quill. Remember back in the dark in the quarantine zone? Thought that was some funky energy thing. Funky energy in the dark. Groot's bioluminescence ain't exactly on the defined light spectrum. Taking freaking forever, I move from sections. Okay, anyone else getting really fed up with little Miss Cryptic? <laughs> Pretty? <laughs> Give me a break. At least it seems less dark through here and less wet. Works for me. Mantis, anything in particular we should be looking out for? I'm trying to remember. I think this is where it gets loopy. Uh, there's that creepy fog again. Oh, goody. It's always here. Always. Until it is. What's that supposed to? Shh. I don't. More Hellraisers. Wait, yeah. But it ain't those Flarknards. It's them creepy eyeball things from the QC. I'm definitely hearing Hellraisers. Then you ain't hearing right. It's eyeball things. Can't tell. Rocket's right. I don't know how it's possible, but I'll never forget that squidgy sound. It's the sound of wet eyeballs hitting the ground. Hold you. It's 
Yeah. Say got loopy. Okay, now that's them bouncing eyeballs from the QC. No question. I'm not doing this. Something is clearly messing with us. Katari? Okay, well that's just wrong. You're worse than her. Those overgrown lizards make clicky sounds. You got moss in your ears. I'm with Groot. Shatari. I'll never forget those things as long as I live. keep looping and there's different stuff that they keep saying so I'm assuming we're going the right way but I'm like after so many times it's like well there's something that we're doing different. Yeah I hear it. What is it? This isn't right. It can't be real. Sure felt real when we were fighting them. I definitely hear more of Hellbender's goons. Love 
because our path back is always blocked. There's only ever one thing forward, and I don't know what the. Occam's razor. Is that some kind of weapon? Yeah, it's an earth thing. Simplest explanation is probably the right one. I hate to break it to you, but you ever tried explaining post retrograde thermography? Ain't nothing simple about it. Something to do with the freaky fog. Every time you name an enemy, it has the power to make that enemy appear. So the key all along was to keep quiet? Yeah, like that was ever gonna happen. I saw so many versions of us fighting so many different things, but the source? It's not done with us yet, Guardians. Yeah, well, let's just keep our eyes open and our mouths shut from now on. The fog entity has retreated for now. There's no immediate risk. Yeah, no offense, bug lady, but nothing. I love that to be like I walked that out, but that was just sheer so the fluke. the fog is an entity now. Yes, sort of. Obviously, if some fog monster is trying to kill us, it means we're getting closer to whatever it is we're looking for. That kind of makes sense. And if this fog monster can make bad things appear, maybe the opposite is true. Like if we all say cure tracks, maybe that's what we've been looking for the whole time. I wish, Star Guy. But no. The one time she gives a definite answer. Let me guess. Further down. Only if you want to save Drax and the whole galaxy. Let me get back to you. Okay, some more stuff to get equipped. I will take it. Uh oh. You hear that? No, what is it? Rushing water. Lots of it. Oh, and the odds of you drowning are getting higher and higher. Okay. One last time! Oh, another face. Okay. I'm not oh, gonna lie, I part. really have no okay. clue what's going on. Okay. Look, guys, um <clears throat> I appreciate what you all did for me back there with the water thing um but following the bug lady any deeper is officially stupid rocket no fog monsters cave pigs wet waterfalls technically all water <laughs> no no quill she doesn't know where we are she doesn't know where we're going she doesn't know what we're looking for mantis are we hot or cold room temperature okay okay this is crazy he is probably crazy. It's not about her. It's about us. I am super proud of us. Because we've never gone this far for anything before. Oh, this is the one where you inspire them. Just think about who we were when we started. Um, well, you were a two-bit broke pirate who couldn't even outrun a tree. Exactly! And you were a two-bit bounty hunter. Just as broke oh. as me. Just as depraved, self-centered, Mindlessly chasing every unit, bar, contract, bank to rob. I still like many of those things. So do I. But none of those things are why we're here now. Right? You're down here kicking ass for Drax. Not Drax the Destroyer, not Drax the Rampaging Criminal. Drax, man! Our friend. Hey, Gamora. You've gone to the ends of the galaxy to hunt people, to hurt people. To get revenge in what? Only assume are some excruciatingly painful ways. But doesn't this feel yeah, kind of good? Going this far to help someone you care about? Oh, it feels so good. And uh, Groot. Uh, he says you don't have to. No, no, I do. Because we all need to learn something from you, man. You never complain. But, or if you do, I don't catch it. But I, I, I'm pretty sure you probably definitely don't. You're always there for us, and that's what this is about. Us. Growing together as a team, following a crazy lady into a death cave because one of us needs help. Because we are a team. Help! We're a family! We're the fucking guardians of the galaxy! Yay! Really?
really great speech, Quill. Why didn't anyone stop me? You're on such a roll! It really was one of your better speeches. <coughs> There's something with the statue, I just don't think I know. Rocket, you need to blast it from the inside. 
to do something else but like he needs to get in there. I know! It's like they want me to keep blowing him up. And I gotta admit, every time they go splat it paints an awfully nice picture. <laughs> There's no way we lose today, Quill. We are painting the battlefield right now, Rocket, in so many shades. But if we're too excited, this love fest, this dazzling euphoria, Come on. we all disappear. Let's Who's get on with that. Me? Can't wait to take him down! Time to blow! Thank goodness. Rocket. Check it out. Still not dead. I can't believe you did that for us. Hey. A friend needed help. Bunch of them. Rocket, man. Yeah. Can we please just save Drax already? Warm? Very, very warm. I think she wants us to jump in the hole. <clears throat> I may not know what we're looking for, but I know it's down there. Okay, let's finish this, because I sure as flock didn't get all wet for nothing. We're literally going down here with no clue what it's for. We need to hurry! I can feel the major of July getting bolder and green meanies mm. flying! stuff cuz i can hear stuff power. it's a cocoon hold you she was going to feed us to some giant bug or maybe she's the bug and that's some kind of cocoon external like digestion sac or adam something adam warlock <laughs> cocoon <clears throat> oh gross please tell me drax is the only one who's got to go in that creepy egg sack so the shepherds found fresh flock <laughs> Yeah, pretty close to Adam Warlock. Foolish followers. Think fast, beard butt. How oh, the... You know nothing. 
not the gravity of your treacherous trespass. <laughs> For oblivion, interloper. Oh, what's this one? Okay, Green Me, you're up. old divine whatever looks pretty good for a dead guy were you not sent by the sanctimonious shepherd us with raker not a chance we're trying to shut his ass down see friends okay big guy and we go come on all the ones where we die already happen that's a cottaging Raker's got half the galaxy going cuckoo bananas, her friend included. I swapped your ass for a newer, younger, blue-skinned model. So, can you help us? Mantis seems to think you can cure Drax. My heavenly healing is veiled malignance. A first folly I swore never to repeat. Ugh, can someone translate this guy? He said no. What protection I can proffer is to remain reclusive. Not this time, Goldie. The pieces need to go back together. We just gotta get you all closer to the puzzle. And that would be... In here, of course. Whoa, wait, let, let's talk about... And we're going into Drax's mind. Fantastic, what? that's well, not terrifying. But! It's like the beginning of Space Odyssey. Welcome to the Astral Plane, Snorlord. Teleported us? Oh, no. You're still comfy cozy with me. I just merged your minds. Merged our what? I gave no consent to this, Planescaper. She's not big on asking permission. It's all pretty sure this and fate of the galaxy that. Don't you get huffy, god guy. Your gold hands are all over this mess. What's that supposed to mean? I thought this guy was how we cure Drax. Cure and cause can coalesce. Yeah, we're walking uh, up to Drax's guys? head. That's terrifying. Is that Drax? <coughs> so we're going into Drax's head. Literally. Green Meanie's in there somewhere. Find him and convince him to come back to reality. Well, that's just terrifying. Mantis, please tell me we're supposed to be going into the bright light. Pretty sure. You need to reach the heart of Drax's promise. Much deeper than I've ever seen. Wait, if you've never seen it, does that mean it never happens? Hope not. Just keep going. And if we lose contact, listen to Amy Winsock. She means you. Quite clearly. Amy Winsock. <laughs> Whoa. This is Drax's promise? Mine was a lot less downery. This is just the doorstep. Poor guy was stuck here. Reliving the loss of his family. Your friend's fear and pain primed him as prey. What do you know about it, Goldilocks? More than I mind. There's the big galoot. That was easy. This is just an echo, little fuzzy. Part of poor Greenie can never stop digging. Until he accepts what's there. You're not the only one that hears that, right? <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Please be something 
Thanos. Drax? Not Drax. Thanos. Bet you weren't expecting a family reunion, eh, hey, Gamora? And the weirdest sure armor is. I've ever seen. Mega belly unlocked. Fight battle barrage. Conquering a traumatic fear of war. Save. <clears throat> From all restraints, he'll now gleefully reveal in turn. I don't know what else to do though. Come get some, you purple dark bag! He just keeps taking everything we threw at him! Next time, you're on your own! What would I do without you, Rocket? Fortune favors failure! Ow! I can't! Peter? Hey, what's happening? That's it! That's why I couldn't see! <sighs> That's a lose. <laughs> How's it going? Been a little while since we've seen you. Hope you're doing good. Oh, okay, we're not going that way. How are you doing? I hope it's going well. Doesn't want us to reach Drax. Maybe Drax doesn't want us to reach Drax. Good. Glad you are doing well. We are just playing through a little bit of Guardians of the Galaxy. I absolutely adore this game. They were this headed has been for the so center. much fun. We should be making our way there. I'm trying. This place is like a maze. Drax! How the... It doesn't matter. Get him! There he is again! Drax, buddy! Wait up! Forced to follow fools. 
Father. You've been playing in your mother's garden again. I was hunting. Hunting dirt? No, I chased it, but it was too quick. Only fools rush forward. A hunter waits, chooses her moment. Drax. <clears throat> Papa? Are you alright? What is that? Yes, little one. Your mother waits. Insidious succubus! Release your thrall! There's no one Kansas anymore. Mark are those! Spawn of shadow! Snuff their source while I widen our They're way! They're coming from those nets! Simply at spawn. That black stuff. I saw something like it in my promise. There will be more. Is that Drax's wife? I think so. Hovat. Then this must All be right. Drax's home. <laughs> you two certainly took your time. Only fools rush. Come, my love. Let us go inside. Drax, buddy. Your words are wasted. Wind. Easy, all right. I got this. Come on, big guy. I know you can hear me. Why do you haunt me? We're gonna lose him again. It's me, buddy. Stormlord, remember? We're all here. You're stronger than this, Drax. Come on, you big lug. Don't leave me alone with Quill. Drax, dinner is ready. That's not Hovat. You gotta let her go. Do not know what you ask. Damn it! Here we go again. All right, so you can destroy just like last time. Make haste. The maw means to snap shut. I cannot contain it. Head on a swivel! Don't pop a blood bag. Ah. Not a 
Many worms. Fuck it, there we go. Endless entropy. Cease that was rain. rough. Come on, Drax. Not good. Clark and nowhere is where we are. Maybe it's not all bad. I don't see any new promise, at least. We are an empty eternal echo. Naked nothingness. Not helping. Old wizard. All right, everyone just split up and look for a way out. Or forward, or whatever. I lose a bet if I die in a dark pit. It was alone in a dark pit. Drax! Come on, buddy. I know you can hear me. This ain't flarkin' funny. I know you're in a dark place right now. Literally. But we're not gonna give up. Just point us in the right direction. There! Look! I can't believe that worked. Let's go. Part of him is still with us. I'm sure of it. I hope you've got one hell of a speech plan, Peter. That makes two of us. Leave me be. You gotta trust us, Drax. We're trying to help. By destroying my home. Your blissful ignorance is an ignoble pursuit. Easy, Shakespeare. You got this. Come on. You don't really want to stay in this dark hole? I would endure the depths of Sarduth to be with my family. Drag slow. It is time to eat. I get it, man. They seem really special. They are the only thing that matters. My Hovat was the most fearless mate I've ever known. Peace even during times of war. My Camarion. My innocent little Camarion. She was the best of us both. Despite her meager stature, they both were. were. They were. There we go. Sinking in. My family is gone. What sits before me? I don't know. But it's not real. It ain't good. It is a perversion. Fed by desperation. Not be alone again. You're not alone, man. We're here for you. We've all lost someone, Drax. But it gets easier if you surround yourself with the right people. I am Groot. Uh, Groot said some mushy stuff. Let's just pretend I said it too. <laughs> Love rocket. <laughs> Papa? Are you okay? Join us, Drax. It's not her. Are you 
hurt, Papa? Talk to us, love. That's what we needed. Oh, he has a form. That's where the darkness is, it's the other part of Adam Warlock. sound mind thanks to you all we were amends for my lapse in judgment hey you don't owe us squat ain't none of us perfect it's kind of our thing <laughs> how much do you remember great darkness grew with every lie that i swallowed the longer i remained with my family the more certain i became that i could never leave you quill your child is in danger if her pain is half my own, the darkness may consume her entirely. Not if I can help it. We gotta be smart about this. There's a whole lot of converted between us and her. A whole lot of that black blorf, too. And anyone wanna tell me why Harry Hobo was able to suck it up? More than why that thing looked like him. Because it is me. Going. Okay. Hey, Goldie Braun. What? All right. Let me make sure I've got. Definitely first. these actual Nova core one. Well am I just like missing so many outfits or like what? What 
get back here and explain that bombshell? Time is tight and your understanding unimportant. Can I shoot him? I got unspent ability points, really? It's gonna be a tough fight. Even in earnest, you underestimate. So, anything you can tell us about what we're up against will be a plus. Mm -hmm. Imagine ambivalent omnipotence drifting in darkness. Uh, speaking of dark. Such was my celestial solitude. Power without purpose, until uncovered by Raker. His crew were convalescent. Plagued by a pox, I was serendipitously suited to soothe. A ship full of sick people just happens upon someone with limitless healing? We were need and needed. Symptom and solace. I worshipped the wonder of my ways and declared me divine. I think we know where this is going. I do not know where this is going. This is the scary part? As the flock of followers fawned, a dark delight developed deep within me. And in the shadows it spoke. Weak whelps, pernicious priesting, feeble fools, fit for feasting. Hubris made hunger. A cancerous craving called Magus. Magus. What did it want? Complete devotion. I too heard this voice and could hear nothing else. Adulation. Flagellation, gorge with grief and consternation. I told you this was the scary part. It was pure putrefaction, sown from the seed of my strength. My soul stone gone sour. I resolved to rip it out. Rip it out? How? A mechanical marvel wrought by Raker would sever the stone from my skull and excise the evil entangled within. Translation. You let Raker steal your powers. Whatever his wayward wander, he was on that day my friend. He swore to separate sanctity from sin, that my healing could yet be harnessed without harm. Sure, but who's harnessing it? Sounds like you were careless. Deluded by desperation. My mind was melding with Magus. Did it work, at least? A savage sense split my soul in twain and cast us to the cosmos. So, no. For me, there was only darkness. I awoke half whole, certain the stone shattered. How Magus merged with another, I know not. I think I can answer that. After I rejected my promise, I got pulled into Nikki's. Perel was there. She was trying to show me something. Peter, you can't trust anything you saw in there. This was different, and it felt different. She took me back to the QZ and I saw that Magus thing. I saw it get all twisted up with Nikki and I... I saw it kill Corel. You hear yourself? How'd she show you this if she's dead? Quite conceivable. Her soul may be snared by the stone, chained to the child. What Corell said. The three of them are somehow connected. She said Nikki needs to accept her death. Magus preys upon her pain, manipulates her mind while feeding on her flock of followers. And I'm guessing it never gets full. Its appetite is insatiable. If unassailed, Magus will absorb all. We're gonna need one hell of a plan. Well, you better come up with it quick, because I see daylight. The bond between Magus and Matriarch must be broken. It harvests its hunger through the host. So, 
Nikki's like the head vampire. If we cure her, it'll free the rest. Why didn't you just say that? <laughs> yeah, I'm not gonna lie. I'm so glad that they were one. kind of felling his own stuff. Step two, convince her mommy. Because I wasn't completely following Step Adam three, Warlock. Get that stone away from her and mop the floor with that Magus thing. You show no shortage of assurance. Yeah, this one's Mr. Positivity. It's enough to make you sick. The stone is both bondage and bridge for Magus, and a young mind is most malleable. If Magus is merged with her, she may not survive this ever. We won't let it come to that. Not to join the Golden Downer, but how are we supposed to find the kid? What are you... What's going... Oh, Flark. Oh, Flark. Go <laughs> here. So screwed. They've got the cortex. They can go anywhere, convert anyone. Sound like you're not coming with us. These are my people. Some still survive if I stay. Then we'll stay and help. Go. I'll be where I'm needed when I need to be. Thanks. Just trust me. Don't go dying. I'm starting to actually get you. Squat golden boy, you're making me nervous. Or perhaps your nerves need gnawing. What did I do? This precarious plan proves more meek by the moment. The Madonna was meant to be among us. She knows what she's doing. Eventually. What sorry sins I have wrought to rest me among such a motley crew. Did he? Did he take my room? Not so much as a yip from the mud. Groot says he'll keep trying. Where's Mr. Fancy Words? It is assumed Peter Quill's quarters. It was a daring display of dominance. Don't you start. Usually I'd say who needs him, but we do. So you better fix this one, Quill. Just try not to piss him off any more than he already is. If it is to be a fight to the death, I will honor the outcome. If he kills you, I get your guns. There's my crowd feed. You bet on Peter winning that fight. It took all five of us to beat him last time. Oh. 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 Oh.